Curtis Bone Crusher Hathaway. We're back. We're still on the hunt. We want that belt back. And the legend Dillashaw is in our way. So let's take care of that. separates these two fighters when it comes to the age with similar height and reach. All right, we're going to weather the storm early each round. And we are underway. Well, with no shortage of momentum, here's the UFC Bantamweight champion, TJ Dillashaw. His striking has gone to a completely different level under Dwayne Bang Ludwig training at elevation there in Colorado. TJ Dillashaw, three-time NCAA qualifier as a Things could get really interesting. Full guard here. And Dizzy as he looks to improve position here. He's trying to spin to the back. Side control again. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Goes upstairs for an elbow. Excellent movement here on the ground. Ground and pass strike there now. Back to side control. Let's go, baby. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. He's now working for full guard. And he landed the right hand there. Save that stamina. Save here, that stamina. Controlling that arm, keeping him from hitting him. All right, let's go. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Fighters back to their feet here. Well, he's playing with fire here, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable to that jab by almost leaning into it right into his opponent's range. Got to find a way to move those feet and ultimately get that head off of the center line. The punch. Okay, okay. Big body shot body. Huge elbow there, Joe. Oh. All right. One for the elbow. Under three minutes remaining. Leaned into that one a little bit. Oh, slips the punch there, Joe. Straight right hand now, just misses. These guys are exchanging huge shots. Oh, effective strike there by Dillashaw. Now he goes for the single leg. Oh, beautiful takedown. Excellent movement on the ground here, always trying to better his position. Went the wrong way. He's now working from side control again. Oh, baby. Trying to take the back here. Went the wrong way again. Full guard. He's in half guard. He's posturing up here. He's back into full guard now. Under two minutes now to go in round one. Lands a good shot from the bottom. Got one in there. Dillashaw Ooh, okay. gets back up again. Oh, powerful right leg kick. Nice punch. Big oh, right hand. Nailed him with the right hand. He didn't miss with that uppercut. Oh. Misses a huge hook to the head. 
Well, I know he's confident in his chin, Joe, but he left his head wide open for that returning hook there. He would be wise to start moving his feet, head on the tips of his toes, and figure out a way to get that head off the center line and out of harm's way. And he pummels out of it. Dillashaw gets double underhooks now. Stuff the takedown, no problem. Okay. Throws it. Nicely done. And busy as he looks to improve position here. 45 seconds remain to the rest. Inside control once again. It looks like he's going to attack that arm. He's got that arm secured. He's got the elbow. Fuck, the come on. Come on. He's got it. Now he wants to lift that elbow up while pushing that hand down. Damn, the arms. That's My it. arms suck. Are they too long? Like, why are they so easy to grab a hold of? But he sunk in the submission and got the victory. Well, Damn. Yeah, so you could tell he was going to stop at nothing. Now to Bruce Buffer for the... God damn it.